Welcome back. In this tutorial, we will learn about all the options available in rectangle command. So, click on rectangle. So, first option is you can create a freehand rectangle, give the first point, give the second point. That is without any dimensions. And if I want to create with rectangle with some dimensions, then you have to take rectangle command, give the first point then here is the dimension option so click on dimension option then specify the length how much you want suppose I want it to be 10 and specify the width I want it to be 5 then you, you have to define on which side you want the other corner so you have to define the sides side of the rectangle and click there so rectangle will, will be created on that side then rectangle then you can create a rectangle with chamfer also so click on this chamfer option then specify the first chamfer distance suppose for you enter then second chamfer distance is also for you then give the first corner point then you will have to make it somewhat larger so that the chamfer will be shown and uh, you can make it freehand or you can create it using dimension also so in this way you can create a rectangle with chamfer same way you can create rectangle using fillet also so for that click on this fillet option then specify the fillet value for you then specify the first corner point and second corner point or give the dimension same way next is chamfer fillet with width also if you need, uh, want some width to the line you can give width also give the width suppose I want width to be 1 enter and suppose I ok it will create with fillet give the first point give the second point so in this way you can create a rectangle using giving thickness width also so if I don't want this fillet then in fillet option you have to click on the fillet option and you have to give the radius to be 0 so that it will create a rectangle without fillet otherwise it keeps on creating with fillet then next option is so in this way you can create using thickness using width fillet and chamfer elevation and width that will see in the last because it is related to 3d then next is if I give again suppose I make this width to be again 0 and I give the first point then you can create rectangle of a particular area also suppose I want some area give the area option then specify the required area how much area you want suppose I want it 100 square unit so whatever is your unit in that unit it will be created so it is a hundred square unit suppose hundred enter then you have to specify the length suppose length to be 10 so automatically a square is created 10 by 10 square is created if you check the area of this rectang uh, rectangle or square area using object option select so the area of the square is hundred so in this way you can create a rectangle using area option same way you can create a rectangle using or a rotation if suppose I want to create a rectangle in some rotation give the give the desired angle suppose I want it to be in 45 degree enter and then you can specify the dimension or you can create it free end so in this way you can create using rotation angle also same way if you if we take this elevation option if we give suppose elevation and we specify elevation of 10 enter and suppose we create one rectangle here first point I don't want it to be rotational so in rotation angle I will give 0 and I specify the second point now where we can view that uh, elevation so for that you you will have to go to 3D modeling click on 3D modeling 
escape then click here on AC isometry here if you orbit it we can view that our rectangle is at a height of 10 from XY plane so that is the elevation that is elevation from XY plane you we are defining in that uh, rectangle command same way if you uh, again we will give rectangle command so now it has been shifted here rectangle and if we give some thickness suppose I give thickness suppose thickness is of 5 enter then give the first point and second point so your rectangle will be created with thickness and if we see view the visual if we change the visual style so a surface is created actually so in this way this rectangle is created at a elevation if we see the front view so this rectangle is created at a elevation of 10 and this rectangle is created at a elevation of 10 with thickness of 5 so in this way if we want to come back click on top view so in this way you can create rectangle in different ways or using all the available options so thanks for viewing we will stop here